What's up, everybody? Welcome to Gizmos. My name's Adam, and I just bought this liquidation pallet for $553. We're going to break it open. I'm going to give you my guesstimate on each item, and then at the end, I'll go through and see what the average selling price is to see how close I get. So without further ado, let's get into these boxes. Professional condenser microphone. This will probably get 30 bucks maybe, but I might actually end up keeping it. Uh, ream of paper. I get a shit ton of these, um, and what I do is I usually shred them up in the shredder, and I use the shreds for uh, packing material. Is that a notebook? Um, Probably like 12 bucks, that's my guess. Fixed wire. Um, I think it's wire, wire mounts. Yeah, that's kind of neat. Probably like 10 bucks. Wireless car charging mount. Actually, my brother wanted one, so that actually works out. Um, but normally it's probably like 30 bucks, 20 bucks. Professional earmuffs. I think they're just silencer earmuffs for working construction, shooting. Yeah. Probably 10, 20 bucks. I know some of the 3M ones go for a lot of money. A pair of broken Sony headphones. Uh, I mean, I'll probably look and see if I can repair them. Um, and some he's used for probably about $15, $20. Otherwise, they just go in the trash. iPhone XS display. Let's see, is it broken? Somebody's used one. I mean, I'm guessing it's somebody's used one. But looking in the light, it doesn't look broken. I don't know, I'll have to test it out. If it works, that's probably, I don't know, 60 bucks. If it doesn't work, I'll, you know, recycle it. Another uh, pair of the Silencer earmuffs. Um, yeah, again, probably like 10, 20 bucks. Uh, USB-C to lightning connector. Uh, I usually just keep these all in a side box, all my cables, and then I sell them for a dollar. White foam tape. I'll probably end up keeping it, but it looks kind of gross, so I'll probably throw it away, baby. Garbage. Air vent holder for your car, probably five, ten bucks. Kingston Orbit Optical Trackball, trackball Mouse. Um, probably 15, 20 bucks. Presuming it works. Looks good though. Electrical tape. It's just a crap ton of white PVC electrical tape. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Um, I'll see how much it goes for. If it's over like 10 bucks, then maybe I'll list it. And if not, it's white tape. I can always use tape. Uh, RGB lighting. Out of the box, it's pretty useless. So, presuming that it works, I can just use it on uh, the set for this or my stream setup. UHF uh, wireless headset microphone. Probably $15. I've sold a couple of these. Oh, Apple Pencil. Is it actually an Apple Pencil in here? Moment of truth. There is one. Get it out of here. It's the first gen Apple Pencil. Looks in really good shape. That's uh, the first gens usually go for about 75 to 90 used. So that's kind of neat. Electrical wire manufacturer. 
Oh. Actually, that's kind of neat. It's a bunch of electrical wire, which I could actually use. So that's convenient. That goes in the save pile. <laughs> Next up, I don't know what this is. Let's open it up and find out. It's a charger for something. Uh, whatever it is, it's broken. So I might just keep the case and any other little tidbits, but the charger's pretty much trash. That sucks. Sony upscaling DVD player. I actually have sold a few of these. Um, they sell fairly quick. And I want to say, I think they're like 30 bucks. So not bad. Get a pair of Turtle Beach. That's a mono headset. I've never seen one of these. <clears throat> I get a bunch of headsets. A lot of them are Turtle Beach headsets. But I mean, it doesn't clip in very good, but it's cheap. It'll probably go in a bargain bin for a buck because it feels really cheap. And it's only one headset, headphone. But yeah. Let's see, lightning to USB cable for Apple. And it looks like somebody sent back their gross ass used cable. That's definitely what they did because there's hair all over it. That's fucking nasty. And yeah, it's shredded. Trash. That was fucking gross. Oh, well, we got another Apple Pencil, first gen. Looks to be in pretty decent shape. So that's, you know, another 70 bucks. I have no idea what the hell this is. It's got suction cup mounts. You know what? It's probably an antenna for a CD player for a car. That is my guess. There's nothing on it, just tell me who makes it. So that's going to be fun research. But my guess is if I can figure it out, 20 bucks, 30 bucks maybe if I'm lucky. And here we have a used spark plug. Okay. <laughs> Don't know why that's in there. Here we have. Hisu or Hisu Wi Fi camera, wire free rechargeable battery, security outdoor indoor camera. Nice, um, probably my guess is around 40 to 60, but after I test it and if it works and it's better than the ones I currently have, I might have to swap one out. Here we have an LED 500 fog machine. Uh, I don't even know if I want to test it. And if it does work, then you know it's a fog machine, so maybe I'll keep it for some cool shots. But if it does work, I know they don't go for too much, so probably 10, 20 bucks. A bunch of uh, white paper, so that'll be used for shredding and packing. And then a pair of some crappy camo headphones. Um, probably 15 bucks, 10 bucks. Little gadgets. I think it's for kids. Presuming they work. All right, let's get on to the next box. Moving on to box number two. Let's see what we got in this one. All right, right off the bat. Xbox One controller. Does it actually have the PC dongle with it? No. 
which is fine because these are Bluetooth. Unless it's buried in this box and it fell out, but I don't think so. I'm just guessing it doesn't. It does not have the PC power adapter. But this one, oh, this is an Xbox Series X controller. This has got the uh, little share button. Uh, it's not on the Xbox One, and it's different. So maybe I will keep this and. Because I already have an adapter, so maybe I'll use it with my PC. Hmm, neat. If not, that's probably what, 50, 60 bucks? Probably 40. Xbox 360. Oh, it's actually in here. How bad is it? Oh, it's not bad at all. Not bad at all. And it's complete. Scratched. It says scratched on a sticker on the back. I mean a little bit, but it looks like it was resurfaced, so I don't think this is a hot commodity. So I don't know if it'll fetch much. Maybe five, ten bucks. But again, I'd have to check. Bunch of Elmer's glue. I usually keep all the school supplies I get and uh, combine them all and just give them to my neighbor because she's got a bunch of kids. USB-C to USB cable. Again, like I said, and I usually just bunch up all the cables that I don't keep, and I put them in a dollar box. I don't really sell anything under ten dollars online, just because of shipping and everything. It ends up coming too much. This is oh, I've had one of these. It does not erase. I don't know if you can read that. I have a different one that's kind of like this. But they're right. It doesn't look like it erases. Oh well. If I can figure it out, maybe I'll stick it in my fridge. Use it as like a grocery list thing. Otherwise, it'll just go in the trash. Here we have a webcam. I doubt it's very good. I'm sure it's just 1080p. Uh, probably 15, 10, 15 bucks. Let's see, looks like Thunderbolt. Oh, it's a bunch of them. I already have a shit ton. Yeah, they're all iPhone cables. Dollar bucks. Here we have a microphone recording mic stand, like the bendy arm, which I usually kind of try to keep these because I do use them and sometimes they break. So it's nice to have an extra. Got a white binder. Again, like I said, I usually just give it to my neighbor. Got a pretty floral, I'm assuming it's a daily planner. Yep, planner for 2021. Well, that's kind of odd. It goes from middle of the year to middle of the year. Huh. I don't know why it was returned. It looks fine. It wasn't written in. I don't know, probably five, ten bucks. But the way it, the um, calendar is, it's a little weird. So maybe I'll just use it and be a little floral for half the year. up we have an iHome Bluetooth mouse for the Mac my guess probably five ten bucks mice aren't that expensive Let's see Apple lightning to DVI it's probably about ten fifteen dollars for these I get them quite often test them make sure that they work Looks like a USB C charger. I can get it open. No, it's not USB C, it's Apple though. 
Maybe it, maybe it is USB-C. I'm wrong. I'm being stupid. So, I'll actually probably just keep that because it's a good charger. If it works, obviously. Hey, here's another one, USB-C power brick. Um, I guess it's probably 10 to 15 bucks since it's Apple. And they go for a premium. Thunderbolt cable, Thunderbolt. Again, same thing, usually 10, 15 bucks. Pile wireless Bluetooth portable speaker. Um, <coughs> um, my guess is somewhere in around 20 bucks. All right, we're almost done here, we're almost done. This is kind of a lackluster shipment, to be honest. Lutron remote control. I don't know anything about them, so probably ten bucks, I guess. Kindle Paperwhite. I think it's just a used screen protector. Yep, trash. Another Apple USB-C uh, power brick. This is a little, I think, full tester or something. Battery charger, class two. Uh, I don't know, probably either trash or 10 bucks, depending. This is another one like the pink camo headset. Yeah, life gadgets. Probably 10, 15 bucks, presuming it works. Bosch, Bostitch uh, pencil, pencil sharpener. Um, these usually don't work. Like most of the Bostitch shit that I get never works. I'll test it. If it works, then I'll actually keep it because I do a lot of drawing. And I've been wanting to keep one of these that I get, but they never work. All right. Case for an iPhone, I'm assuming. I don't really get many other cases for anything else. And they never really sell, so. Five, ten bucks, maybe. High life proof, waterproof, wireless speaker. Um, probably 20 bucks actually. These actually have some value. Um, I'll have to double check, but as long as it works. And they usually sell really fast. So this. What are you? I don't know. Um, I think it's like a laptop stand. Yep. Um, these I usually keep see what they're like and then like I've used a couple of them that I've gotten before they're usually opened or you know don't sell very well and then here we got an Apple pencil generation 2 is it actually in here it is and it's the actual uh, get the focus Apple Pencil these actually go for quite a bit um, like 120 roughly so that's neat we've got just about $300 in Apple Pencils so got a red switch controller right handed it looks like it's in there it looks like it's in good shape I have a black left controller, so maybe I'll bundle them up, sell them for 40 bucks. Otherwise, I think this is 20 or 30 on its own. Assuming that it works, which I have not had much bad luck when it comes to um, Nintendo stuff. Lightning to headphone jacks, I usually just keep these in a box with a bunch of the same shit. I list them for five, 10 bucks. Nobody ever really buys them. 
crap load of big gel pens, which like I said, I draw and I color. So I'll probably just keep these because I don't, how do you sell this? You don't sell this. You give it to my neighbors for their kids or I'll keep them. Who knows? This is a breast pump uh, <laughs> motor or pump, the actual pump. Oh no, it's the AC power adapter for the breast pump. So, I mean, that'll actually probably sell. That's probably 10 to $20. We got a pair of ear pods with the lightning conduct the connector. Um, from the looks of the top of this, it's probably used. They're not back in there properly. Probably end up throwing them out. See, we got some paint sharpie markers. I'll definitely keep those. I use those for things, especially writing on black paper. See, we got a pair of junk Panasonic headphones that are buried in there. Again, probably used, probably trash, because it's not worth cleaning or anything when they're only like $10 new. We got an outer box. For the Moto E5. Um, I mean, it looks in good condition. Doesn't look really used. And if I can sell it, probably about 10, 20 bucks. So, I mean, going through all this, most of the stuff in here is mostly between 10 and 20 dollars. So you think 50, 50 items, 10 dollars, about 500 bucks. If I moved everything. But I should make my money back as long as these are unopened. I'll make my money back off those Apple pencils and this ink. And let's see. It looks good. That doesn't look good. Oh, maybe it does. It's glued. I think that's how they come. Let's check these. Alright, this one's absolutely opened I'm pretty sure I don't want to open them because if I as long as I don't open them they're still sellable this doesn't look fucked with you know these look fine and these are about 120 each but I have a company that buys all name brand sealed ink from me at a good price so usually I sell it to them but yeah, otherwise, that's it. Those are our two boxes.